All right, teachers. So if you have a home page when you pull up Firefox and you don't want that home page anymore to be what pulls up when you open Firefox, you want it to be whatever you've been working on. What we were going to do is we're going to set this home page just as one of our bookmarks, and then we're going to change it so that when we open Firefox, it's going to go back to what we were last working on. So right now, this page is my home page. What I'm going to simply do is just click this star because it's going to bookmark it. And I can just change this to technology, move it to the toolbar, click done. So now it's a bookmark right on here. I'm going to close that because I don't need it. These two things we're going to pretend that I was working on, which was my Seesaw class and a Google Doc. Now, what I'm going to do is I want to say to Firefox that I want it to open this way. So you're going to go to these three lines. You're going to go to Options. In Options, on Startup, which pops up, it's going to Restore Previous Session. Okay, we're going to click that. Now we can close out of options. We're going to close Firefox. We're going to pretend we just had to do a startup. Now, when we click on Firefox after we restart our computer, after it wants to do its update, which we love to wait for for Firefox, we will wait for it, wait for it. It's going to be exciting. Building the anticipation. And what should come up should be what we were last working on, those two tabs. Once Firefox loads, wait for it. It's awesome. It's going to be so much growth. <gasps> and here it is. We've got our tabs open again. Of course, when they have the update, they throw this one here at us. Thank you. But it restored our two tabs that we had working on. So it's great for kids to have that home page to land to. But as adults, we might want to just go back to whatever we were working on when we have to close our device. Plus it helps you if you have to restart in the middle of the day. Hope this tip helps.